Don't think like if you have millions of dollars you can go and buy and these pieces are out of catalog models. Should go to Patrick Philippe boutique and wait at the door for 50 years. When you talk about piece unique, special watches, then the Rolex is cheap. This watch was selling for eight million dollars. <laughs> we will be banned <laughs> for today's conversation. Yeah. Hello everybody and today we are again with the biggest watch trader of UAE. Khalid, how are you doing? I'm, I'm good, thank you. Uh, great, so and we are uh, having a piece unique, a best of the best watches today to see. Like everybody else, I know you love piece uniques and some rare and limited pieces. We got few of them over here in the tray, but we have a lot more. We handpicked some of them. Great, so for me today, I want to focus on the biggest resale value watches. Well, I always say the biggest resale value is always Patek Philip, Richard Mille, AP and Rolex and FP John, MBNF. They are very good brands also. I'm not sure if you have heard about them. I did. It's yeah. a very niche brand. They make like less than 1000 pieces a year, MBNF and uh, FP Jean. Okay. What is the most expensive out of them? Uh, out of here is this one. Look at this piece. This is uh, crazy, something crazy. Yeah. It's, and it's heavy. Imagine your camera missed this piece. This one is RM5201. RM5201. It's skull. Okay. The watch is tourbillon with ruby. Turbion with ruby. Yes, and it's white gold. How right. much this watch, I sold it when the market was at its peak. When the market was at its peak? March 2022, the peak is over. Mm. Then it started coming down. September 2023, after 18 months of continuous down, it started to be more stable. No, it's kind of stable, stable for six months. This watch was selling for eight million dollars. This watch? Eight million dollars, really? yes, this. But today our offer is not this. Today my offer is 3.7 million US dollars. It's piece unique, one of one, in white gold, skull, tourbillon with ruby. The watch is beautiful. Absolutely. See. So this all rubies? It's rubies, yes. Yeah, and white gold. Yes. So the only one piece? And how did you sell before? I bought it back. <laughs> <laughs> cut. <laughs> yes. Okay, we'll cut. Yes, no, it's, it's funny. It's a little bit there. Then how is it? The... <laughs> okay, if this piece is unique, yes. then how you sold it before for the 8 million? No, we, these watches always comes back. <laughs> goes and comes. It's like uh, an asset. So you bought it back? Yes. For uh, how much? Mm, that's a secret. Okay. <laughs> Trade secret. I show Incredible. you something else? Yeah. This watch is limited to five pieces. I tell you something funny and uh, interesting at the same time. This watch is limited to five. Okay. But six is in the market. How? Fake? No. <laughs> <laughs> it was six pieces was sold by the brand. Yeah? Okay. Six pieces was sold by the brand, but it's limited five pieces. How is that? You know what's the number of the watch? No. It's zero from five. Ah. Ah, okay. So this was... So five pieces they sold. This is the prototype. They resell it. You they, know? they sold the prototype. They sell the prototype. Sometimes some VIP customers, they come, they say, Ah, I love this one. I want this. Then the brand says, this is the five piece limited. They're all sold out. So, but do you know who I am? Yeah, if it's a client of the client. You like... cannot make one for me. You know who I am? They say, okay. But what to number it? No, number zero. <laughs> so this number is zero from five. How much? It's two million dollars. 
No, it's no. Tourbillon. It's very light. They made in 2019 this model. The model reference number is RM502701. I always say this is the baby of uh, Boba Watson and uh, uh, Rafa. If Rafa gets married to Boba, the outcome will be this. <laughs> okay. Yes, this is a tourbillon, a skeletonized, super light, the quartz uh, NTPT case. Yep. This is a speed tail. Limited 106 pieces. It's for those boys who have uh, McLaren speed tail. You need to have the watch also. To have this watch also, you should have that car. It's mm. profile. And to have that car, you must have other good cars, you know. Wait, it's, uh, so they, it's, they're it's, You have to get, you have to have a profile on the boat side probably. <laughs> With the cars and the watch, it's not easy to get pieces like this. No, are you serious? It's a request from the brand to have this car? Yes, they collaborate, yeah. Yeah, yes, okay. it's collaboration between RM and McLaren. McLaren. Yes. So you need to have a certain model of McLaren, then you can purchase the, this watch. To get that car also itself, it's not an easy job, you know. Okay. It's a profile car. You say how many Mercedes you have, how many SLR you have, and what other car you have, what Ferraris. You have a good profile. Of it's a hell, guys. The rich people going through the struggle. Yeah, too much struggle. There is rich people to yeah, enjoy more. Yeah, I know. More, I didn't huh? know that it's more. so hard. <laughs> yes, it's now not I easy. Know. Yes. Yeah. Don't think like if you have millions of dollars, you can go and buy you and cannot purchase. cannot just you, go and buy. There are many millionaires uh, in the world, yeah? Fighting there is war them. between them also. Okay. War, not, uh, war is not only in the poverty. War is in the... Top-notch community. There's a bigger war there. <laughs> See? Now we know. Yes. And the price of the watch in the boutique is $1.1 million. $1.1 .1 million. Yes. And here? Exceptionally, I have a really good price. If I say the audience will faint, so I will prefer to that keep it... That they already faint. <laughs> no, I prefer to keep it private. Okay. Very special price. Higher or lower? Today is uh, the day of whoever is watching this video. Okay. So we have few deals on the table for unbelievable prices. Yep. Had it ignoring some of my questions purposefully. Oh, yes. What was <laughs> I it? asked. It will be higher or lower than retail. No. Here is the trick. This watch was selling above the retail for three times. It was okay. $2.89 million. Okay. The watch. One million. Uh, More than two times. Mm. But I have a special price this time below retail. Okay. Yes. Retail. How much below retail? It's a secret. Only the serious buyer should come and ask. So in the comment, the serious buyer can write, I will engage you with the colors. Serious, serious buyer, but buyer. still you have to be multimillionaire. A photo with McLaren attached. <laughs> with your photo, with the, you have to take the selfie with the, with the McLaren, <laughs> but not uh, cheating. Huh? In the road, any McLaren you see, you take selfie. No, let's, then, <laughs> let's take photo with Beyonce. You have to send the Milkia, we say. Ah, the McKeon. registration card uh, that the McLaren in your name. Yeah, McLaren. Then you have a big discount, special price here. <laughs> <laughs> For your struggle. <laughs> don't send, if you have a Toyota Corolla, don't send the registration, please. <laughs> you cannot afford the watch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this model of Patex that comes with diamond or with ruby, okay, nobody knows how many pieces actually being manufactured, but it says like, five pieces a year Patek mix. Mm. And these pieces are out of catalog models. Okay. It's not even in the Patek Philippe catalog, so you can choose and put your finger on it, I want this watch. No, not like that. It's only VIP people. The brand creates something a little bit different for them. So yeah, it's special it's for some certain special clients made. Differently. For the client with high profile, these pieces, you see? Yeah. It's wrapped in plastic, so the More. they don't... <coughs> they wrap in plastic. These are the most beautiful pieces of Nautilus. The, I say Patek Philippe is the king of the brands. 
and uh, in the Nautilus, Nautilus is the king of Patrick Philip. Nautilus, ah, yes, this model. Yeah, mm. and these models are the king of Nautilus, so it's the kingdoms. So this is the peak of the, everything. This is not the most expensive, but the most wanted, and the most wanted. they are very expensive pieces as well. well. How much? Uh, the ruby is 650,000 US dollar. From okay. retail or from you? I mean, my price. Your price. Yes, who cares what's the retail? Yeah, because you cannot get it from the retail. Who cares what's the retail? Am I right? Nobody cares because uh, probably you have to wait uh, 50 years to get. Nobody cares what's the retail. Even though after the drop and market is more settled and price correction taking place, it's still it's way above the retail. You want the retail? I give you the address. You should go to Patrick Philip boutique and wait at the door for 50 years. <laughs> you will get at retail. <laughs> it's not at retail still. Okay. Thank you so much, Khaled. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So while I'm here, you already changed uh, three cups. So this is <laughs> <laughs> this is. I, I'm blinking and you are changing the cups. I feel well, like that. I'm not big fan of cups normally. But these ones are different. It's coming from the brand itself. Okay. The only cups I have is Patrick Philip, AP, Richard Mill, Rolex. I keep collecting the cups, but I never talk about it because it's not that expensive like the watches to talk about it. But it's still it's just what, a hobby. Can you repeat what you, did you say about Rolex cup? Uh, no, not the Rolex cup. <laughs> no, you said the Rolex watches. <laughs> Ah, you said, what did you say? I when you remove that, your Rolex cup? <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I just had the Rolex cup and I switched it quickly to yes. Patek. I said it's too cheap. Great. The Rolex, uh, when you talk about piece uniques, special watches, uh, ultra expensive, then the Rolex is cheap. With all the love and respect. The Rolex is like Toyota. It's easily cashable. <clears throat> Everybody, every age, every nationality, they it love it. It's reliable. It's very reliable, but it's not that expensive. Okay. Ninety percent of their models are cheap. So yeah. here you brought cheap. Them. I mean, what, it's still a luxury brand, but compared to high, high, super high end, they're cheap Whoa. in the industry. And, and that's not the Rolex marketing strategy to be the world's most expensive watch. But they are the world's most famous ones. Yes. Do you know how many Rolex they make in a year? How many? Just guess. No, it's thousands. 1.2 million watches they make every year. Oh. And how many watches uh, Patek Philippe? How many? They manufacture 65,000. See the gap. Seriously? An AP? 45,000 watches a year. 45,000 only? Yes. And Richard Mille? This guy is uh, something... How huge. many? Less? 3,800. Less than 4,000. I can buy all their watches and reprice. Seriously? Only 3,000? Yes, it's very few watches. So, wow. you know, the Rolex is not rare. 4,000 and 1.2 million. Uh, where are they? We are far away from each other. Okay. So, it's a different market. So half uh, here <laughs> and your Richard Mille and half in the boutique. <laughs> yeah, kind of. I, I love this brand. You love Richard, Richard Mille guy is one of... See, some people in this watch industry, they leave uh, their footprint in the industry forever. Mm. You know like who? Like John claude Beaver. You know this guy? Yeah. He's the man who brought Hoblo from nowhere to the top of the game. You know uh, Gerald Charles? He's the man who designed the Nautilus, uh, you know, he, a lot of other successful models in the industry. But I never saw so, Hublot here in, at your place, at your boutique. Oh, it's, we have Hublot and all Rolex is next door. It's oh. my brother takes care of them. I take care of a little bit more expensive ones. Uh, the brand uh, Richard Mill, the man, very smart. Jacob, very smart guys. These, these people, they... The industry and the watch lovers, they never forget these people. They are in the history. 